Okay, so we're down here in Streatham. Uh, lads are just getting prepped up on this job this morning. So this is a real big one. So what we're gonna be doing on this project is brick cleaning all the brickwork uh, back to its natural color. Then we'll be cutting out and replacing all of the damaged bricks. So all of the bricks you can see They've all been filled in sand and cement in the past. We'll be cutting all of them out. We're going to be re-rendering these bottom panels on the bottom there. So all of these bricks, you can see they're all spoiled and damaged, these ones. We'll be cutting out and replacing all of them. All of these bricks down here at low level, they'll be cutting out and replacing, rendering these bottom panels all of the way through. Uh, this is all going to be done in a penny roll finish, all in natural loam mortar going to return it all of, the, all of the white paint will be coming off all around the inside of the door as well and it's going to return round to here so a nice straight line finishing there Let's just show you upstairs so upstairs um, all of the brickwork through here again there's going to be lots of bricks to cut out and replace you can still see the original tuck pointing on the archwork on all of the Red detailing through here. Same sort of again, just bricks to cut out and replace, really bad spalling bricks to be cut out and replace everywhere. All of these old repairs, we'll cut all of these out and do all of them properly. New fillets all around the top here, we'll be doing that. And we'll be decorating all of the wi uh, window seals as well here, removing all of these car uh, down pipes, sorry, removing all of them so we can get behind everything properly. Had so many patchwork done in the past with all the old sand and cement mortar. So we'll be cutting all of that out, getting rid of it, all this horrible sand and cement. I think it has been cleaned in the past. Um, looks like it has been cleaned in the past. Quite a lot of spalling again on these red detailing bricks through here. Um, Works all been done in sand and cement. We're doing all of the collar joints, so taking out these big horrible collars and redoing all of the collars all the way through on all of the windows. Upstairs, it's going to look stunning. This when this project's all completed, it's going to look really, really nice. Again, more bricks to replace any old cables that need getting rid of we can get rid of them like this these old dead cables that are just loose get rid of them all of the detailing work all through here so we get all of this staining off and these beautiful decorative bricks hone all them in properly going to be more bricks to replace all around this pediment here all up this area here really bad blown bricks all of the way through there and then we've got another lift after that. So, yeah, it's a real big job, this. We're gonna have quite a few guys on this next week, about three or four this week. And then we'll get a few more guys over here next week to, well, two more lifts, shall I say. Yep, all the way along here. Yeah, I think it's definitely been cleaned in the past and probably a little bit of patch pointing's been done when it was cleaned. So we'll clean all this properly. Get it back to one lovely neutral colour. Yeah, all these old seals, all this old paint, we'll get rid of all this old paint. Strip all that, looks like an old gloss paint, so we'll strip all of that and get a nice colour going on all the way through there. And then right up to the top, all of this got to be done as well. So, yeah, this is a good sized project, this one. A big old lump so i'll have to start getting materials over here soon get all of the sand over here all of the bricks so the lads have got everything they need all they've got to do is just turn up in the morning and i'll get everything here over for them so they can just crack right on rope and wheel getting all the gear up so that's always good to see um so yeah so this one will keep us busy for a good few weeks um customers are really excited that we're finally here uh, getting the project underway and uh, we will turn this into a stunning project as always so we will show you some more progress um, on this project in the next week or so i'm off now to carry on on another job with some other lads getting some more decorating done and then once we free them guys up we'll have some more guys over here giving these lads a hand over here so um like I say, if you've got any questions or you'd like a free quotation for any services, please give us a call, get in contact 
and we'd be more than happy to assist you as always. Thank you very much. Good morning, so we're back down here on our Stretham job, um, just a little video showing you how we're getting on. Um, the lad's been cutting out all of the brickwork all the way through. Um, this area here is in real bad condition, so it looks like we're going to have to take down and rebuild this section, get all new handmade bricks all of the way through. All of the bricks are all completely loose, all crumbling and spalling all the way through there so this is this area is definitely going to need a lot of attention all the way through there but all of the rest of the work so far is going well lads like i say just carry on cutting out all of these bad bricks to show you upstairs and downstairs in a second so uh, real big job this one A lot of the cement pointing has done a lot of damage to the brickwork over the years, just spoiling all of these red brickwork. And we've got areas that have been rebuilt in solid sand and cement, so it's a tough, tough cut out this one. Um, but we'll get there in the end eventually. A uh, customer wants us to take this seal out and replace that seal um, so it matches the original seals on the property so we'll get new seals made up for them i think there's two in total to be made up for them there's a lot of cracking and that going through these seals here they're all blown that's all completely cracked all the way through there so that's all going to be restoring upstairs same sort of thing it's all been rebuilt in solid sand and cement up there and then Lads are sheeting up all the doors today. We're going to remove all of the paint from inside the front door area. So just taping up all of that inside there. We'll start getting all of the paint off of there. Um, all this lovely detailing work will bring all that back up to a lovely feature all around here. So that's the detail we've got to put on the window seals. I think we've got one that seal there. And then this is the other seal we've got to replicate. Obviously that detail to there as well. So we're gonna have a look and see what we got underneath here. If we've got original bath stone, then we're gonna hone them in and have them back to original stone. If not, we'll strip them all and decorate them all. All had to just get prepared now to start cutting out. I'll just show you a little bit downstairs. Okay, so we're down here on our stressing project. This is just a little update video of how the boys have been getting on. So all of the brickwork is starting to be clean now. Um, cutting out and replacing all of the damaged bricks. Just done up over here today, unloading everything for the boys. So they've got all the materials they need. Let's have a little walk around and show you everything that's been done. So the bricks are coming up really nice. All of the pointing looks like it's all been cut out now. So we've got loads of bricks to repair. All of these special bricks to repair. Um, individual bricks to cut out and replace so the boys are going to carry on now with all of these um, bricks cutting out and replacing all of these damaged bricks I've got my uh, brick maker coming on Monday to uh, measure up all of these bricks and see what bricks we need so all of the bricks where needed will be cut out and replaced a um, couple of window seals to be changed to the original mold like you can see there 
looks like taking out all of the collar joints all around the windows as well so the lads just marking up with the chalk all of the bad bricks that are unsavable once it's all been cleaned but yeah look like they're making good progress so hopefully we get some muck on the wall soon and start the repointing over here oh, very cold again this morning feels like a late november's morning really fresh um but yeah now this is starting to take shape now looking really really good like i say in the previous video i think this is all going to have to come down and rebuilt rebuilt over here all of this is so loose in areas so i think structurally we'll take it down and rebuild all of that so i think what we'll do get all of the pointing done leave this area here get all of the handmade bricks done and then come back and rebuild that but yeah lads look like they're doing well over here so they're making good progress so hopefully a good couple of weeks work over here and i reckon this will all be pointing keep the four lads over here that are working over here and then um hopefully have some progress to show you middle of next week late part of next week how it's all going once the pointing's on the wall because this is going to look beautiful this project now once it's all been repointed it's going to set it off really really well so all good over here the lads are all getting all the materials off the van okay, getting all the bricks that i loaded up yesterday all of the sand lovely houses down this road in stretton beautiful big victorian houses really nice features on these houses so yep all good over here i'm going to take the rubbish away with me now get all of the bricks off the van all of the sand off the van and then load up all of the rubbish to keep the front of the house nice and clean for the customer so yeah this is just a little update of um how we're getting on over here Right, so this is our Stratton project to show you a little video of how the lads have been getting on. Um, so, they've started the pointing now, so we've been working on all of the um, penny roll pointing on all of the London stop it work. As you can see there, looking really, really good. So we're leaving all of the red detailing brick to once all of the handmade bricks are in down low level, and then we'll start repointing all of that level downstairs done the samples for the customer to choose from so we are doing this finish here perfect as always so that's going to look really good on all of the reds all of this yellow detailing up against that's going to set it off really well right let's have a look upstairs see how they've been getting on up here oh. so all of the penny roll all the way through there all through there so all of this will be done in the same penny rolls downstairs but all the new bricks being made all for this area throughout there as well yeah this is looking really really nice now taking lovely shape perfect finish right let's have a look upstairs so we've got the window seals will be in place as well so Oh, you're all up here? I thought it was all down the calf. Couldn't hear no one. Huh? No. <laughs> How are we doing? Oh, and then all through here. And Cold and wet, James, yeah. That's crap, isn't it? Hello, mate. <laughs> and then up there. Hello, Sergey. Hello, mate. All mate. Oh, dear.
welcome back to another video. I've uh, been really quiet lately on the social media side of things, but we are back with a bang today. And um, what a project we are back with. So um, we've been working on this project in Streatham for around about the last um, two months. Uh, about five or six guys on this job, uh, like I say, for a, a good seven to eight weeks minimum. Um, we've been really busy behind the scenes doing lots of other projects so we're going to get back on the social side of things uh, show you lots of jobs that we've been working on um, what we've been doing on each project and we'll start off with uh, this amazing project that looks like you see it, it looks incredible so um, I'm going to turn the camera around now and I'm going to give you a walkthrough of everything we've done on this project so let's get going Right, so here we are down in Streatham in South East London. This is our project all completed now. So let's give you a walkthrough of everything we've done. We'll start off at the ground floor. Um, so what we did was we brick cleaned all the brickwork back to its natural color, um, first of all. Then we cut out all the old cement pointing and that was all the way throughout the building. Right at the top was all rebuilt. It was a real hard cut out all the way to the top. Uh, brick cleaned all the brickwork and then repointed it all in a combination of a penny roll finish on all of the red features, all the red banding, and then our penny roll style pointing on all of the London stock brickwork. So we start off at the bottom. So what we've done is we've done a new plinth on the base of the property that goes all the way around the base. Used to have a real high uh, rendered plinth going all above them chamfered brick stairs. So we've reduced that all the way down to, I believe, two, three, two courses of brick there, and then it rises to three courses of brick there. Put some nice new period air vents in all of the way through there. So we've got four, four in total. Yeah, four air bricks in total there. Then all of the brickwork, all repointed in natural lime mortar in a penny roll finish. The plinth goes all the way around the base of the property around there as well you can see how sharp all of the irises are on the plinth beautiful finish as always um, all of the paint was all stripped from around the inside of the door here so all of that's all being done now in our penny roll finish then you've got the uh, penny roll on the London stock brick see how nice that looks up against the penny roll point in there. We've put new, we had about 200 handmade bricks made for here. So let's give you a walk through upstairs and show you everything up here. So we put um, all new handmade bricks in. If you look back on our previous videos, you will see how this project looked before. All of the area above the front door, all of the, whoops, all of the archwork there, all new handmade bricks gone in there. Look how nice all of that's looking now. Got a little bit of salt coming out of the bricks in areas, but that'll dry out just where it was so damp in areas before. So all of the beautiful pointing all of the way through above the front door. Then all of the banded pointing coming all the way through there. The arches all tuck pointed all the way through again you can see that penny roll pointing it does look slightly different in areas when you're videoing in the light but that sort of gives you an idea of how the penny roll pointing looks new cast window seals they're all ready for painting now so that was all square before i lost the original detail there was the original profile on the window seals there so we've replaced i think it's five seals in total on here so they're all in now as well then upstairs we took down and rebuilt the main section of brickwork up here so i'll just show you that so all of this section here was taken down and rebuilt had all the handmade bricks put in and rebuilt all of that area right down to this level here there as well all of the flaunching all the way around all of the chamfer bricks all the way through there and again just the penny roll pointing coming down on all the coins all the way through there so the decorators here now just decorating 
all of the woodwork just to finish off this beautiful transformation so full preparation on all of the windows now decorating all of the all of the window seals at the same time upstairs show you a bit up there in a second yeah unfortunately we were supposed to do both houses actually we were supposed to do this house and the house next door um just chatting to the lady then unfortunately she didn't want to wait um for us she couldn't wait and uh we've taken the scaffolding down and i think she's um slightly regretting not using us now because they've done it all in a sand and cement in the wrong material in a weather strop finish and we've done it all in the penny roll finish in natural lime mortar and yeah she can massively see the difference now so it is worth waiting sometimes like she said the price between both jobs wasn't even that much different so she's uh, kicking herself about that this morning um so up here oh again real hard areas up on the roof to get into real challenging job in areas getting all the way through there but as always perfect no weather struck pointing no painting bricks yellow we see a lot of that now where people are not doing the replacements properly you see loads of it on social media they're just doing a yellow brick repair and then just painting all of the bricks yellow it's not the way to do it always cut the bricks out and replace them properly so like i say we've replaced over 600 bricks on this project all the handmade bricks um, all replaced all the london stock bricks replaced properly so when you're having these jobs done and you're getting quotes just make sure that you are getting a proper job done and just not brick repairs unless you obviously ask for a cheap job to be done and you're happy with brick repairs but just remember they don't last and a lot of time people are just use cement tones anyway on the repairs and they're not they're not going to last long at all so all of this area up here that's all been done all through there all of the flaunching again all the way through there um so yeah like i say this looks incredible this project from down on the street looking up looks really really good lads have done an amazing job it was a tough tough job this like i say all of this area up here was all built in rock hard sand and cement it was a real hard cut out um, nothing was easy about this job everything had to be rebuilt in areas again there's another window seal going that was in there another seal we put in now but overall um outstanding uh project finished to the highest standard as always the customers are absolutely over the moon with how this project looks now uh, i've just got to speak to the customer now he wants me to look at doing some more work on the back of the house um and then we can get the scaffolding down now in time for christmas just get these windows painted the plinth i believe is going to stay the same color they really like the look of the plinth up against the cast iron air vents i'll just show you downstairs how it looks from down on the street level just here this morning clearing all the last of the rubbish i think this is the sixth load of rubbish that we've removed from this job so many bricks like i say we've replaced but yeah i'll give you a little look at it from there and if you walk up to the front door i've got a beautiful front door just the lights now set it off needs a new bulb in that one but lovely steps to match as well but i will come back once the scaffolding down is down and show you how it all looks once all of the scaffolds down once all this decorating's done so like i say um i'm going to show you the house next door that was done i think it was a month before we came to do our one she just couldn't she just said she just couldn't wait so you can see the difference now let me get a bit of an angle having it all done properly cleaned properly compared to the sand and cement where we struck pointing and all of the brick repairs so um like i say this is just the first of many jobs that i'll put back on social media because we have been neglecting the social side of things lately we've just been so busy just trying to do everything at once is quite challenging so there you go that's our Stratton project all completed now that's off to the lads i wasn't here on this one i've been doing a lot of decorating myself and other jobs trying to keep up with the 
workload so these lads can get in front and just carry on with all of the um, pointing work and keep these customers happy with our schedule of work. So we're fully booked now to around about mid -March, mid late February, early March now. The lads are working on another massive job in Dulwich around the corner. So I'm going to go there in a minute and show you all the other jobs that we've been working on and get all them videos. So if you do like the look of this project and you'd like a free quotation for any services we offer, um, please give us a call, get in contact, and we'd be more than happy to assist you as always. Thank you very much.